When you think they were about to make space history, Haley Arsenault and Cyan Proctor looked remarkably relaxed. So too, Jared Isaacman, the billionaire who paid SpaceX to make this happen, and Chris Sembrowski, the first all-civilian crew to orbit the Earth. Five months of training had brought them here, non-professional astronauts ready to blast off. Into the night sky of Florida, it went without a hitch. It was a spectacular show for those watching across a huge area, witnessing with the world a new dawn in the space race. They will orbit for three days, travelling at 17,000 miles per hour and 360 miles up, realising a dream for the billionaire not with them. The reason I started SpaceX was to get humanity to Mars. It is Elon Musk's company that's enabled a story being documented in a Netflix series and with the aim of raising millions for a children's cancer hospital. These are significant times in this new space race. First Richard Branson and then Jeff Bezos flying to the edge of space in craft their millions built. Experts say the SpaceX launch is a game changer in commercial space travel. They're going higher, uh, they're in orbital space, they're, they're in orbit around the Earth. Um, they're not minutes, they're days uh, where they're going to be there. They have actual um, mission objectives that they're trying to achieve. Um, and so I think, it, you know, it's an order of magnitude uh, more of a challenge to be able to do an orbital flight. Jared Isaacman named this mission Inspiration. With the hospital mascot along for a zero-gravity ride, it is as much about making a difference as making history. Greg Milam, Sky News.